Check back in like an hour, I'll have her done. All right, new day in the shop. We're working on the rat rod tow truck again. Today's order of business is exhaust. We gotta get exhaust up over the transfer case and out the back so that we can finish the rest of things. So here we go on exhaust. Doesn't look very yeah, difficult at all. That's less room than I remembered it having. I think we get a torch and a rosebud and we heat this header up, put the jack on it right there and just give it push some, it up till it's pointed towards the floor. Give it some love. I think we ought to bolt it to the manifold solid. We only, only got, got two bolts in it. Yeah. I think we probably ought to. If we don't, we're gonna tweak the rest of it. Okay. And then we're gonna have a worse well, day. Let it back down. There we go. Is that all the header bolts? I have a whole handful. Here's the other three if you want them. All right, lots of heat. How far up do we have to go to get? Oh, almost to the top. In theory, we're gonna be able to heat these corners up right here and get them all hot, and this is just gonna twist right up there. Yes. Yeah, I like that idea. I like your thing. You're gonna have to get them all hot, it's a thing. I heat this way. See if you can get the whole bend. Put that pink on it. Lifting the trunk up? Yeah. We got pressure on it now, so. Coming back down, you're doing something. Slow baby glow. Oh yeah, she's moving. That's probably good. We'll just leave it there and let it cool off now. Here Safety we go. Safety first. Safety and third in this shot. That's right. Look at that. Did you see that? Drop catch. <laughs> Dropped it with one hand, snacked it with the other. I was born in the wrong era. I should have been a gunslinger back in the 1800s. I like it. I like it, Picasso. Yeah, we'll have enough. Kink it up. Let's build the easy one first. Okay, I, I'm, yeah. Sold. I'm on that. Abla, 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 sold. I'll get the fender. This is all by uh, the seat of our pants right here. It's gonna be close-ish. This one's gotta bend more and that one's gotta bend more to bring it over, right? Oh yeah, you gotta go up farther or else we're gonna get our lever. I just need to bend this one more. That's barely. You like that? Yeah. Okay, you can pull it out. We can cut that off square and then we can weld that to that. This one's gonna be easy. This one, not so much. Well, it cuts a little smoother than the other one. All right, we swelled that up. We got a little gap to fill around it, but it's gonna be not too bad. Let's uh, try that and see how it fits. It's gonna work. This. Ben, you wanna come hold this? Yep. Is that gonna hit? Can you turn it? Turn it the other way. Do you like that? I'll hold it up. He's strong. Oh yeah. I don't know. Headers are too big. Yeah. Said no one ever. Yeah, it's mostly there. It ain't gonna fall off. I got the top to do, but smoking. Cool. Well, I'll go back over to the bench and weld that in. Okay. Nice and warm. We'll let her cool down. I guess I can weld that from the top, can I? We'll let it down and find out. Yeah, Taking the drive line out. Taking the drive line out so we can get. While we got the drive line out, we'll build that other little piece. Yep. Right there. Especially now that we can. Uh... Hey, don't you think about that? I think I'm gonna move these back over onto the frame where I had them, or onto the in line. They gotta move a half inch over. We'll cut those loose and put them back. I'm gonna like them better there. We can get some exhaust up over this today. We gotta drill a hole too. In what? A couple holes. We gotta drill and tap these holes. Uh huh. And then drill the long one through. And then one through there. Uh huh. And then we gotta skin it. And then we gotta build the other part to it back there. We gotta quit looking at it because there's more work to do every time we look at it. Ah, there's a good solid, what? Six weeks of work? That we gotta have done in four. 
Trail Hero, this thing needs to be running. I need some seat time so I can whip on Matt in the tow truck Olympics. Whip on him. And Rory, you can't forget Rory. We gotta whip on Rory as well. That's right. We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna need to cut some floorboard. More? Oh yeah. We're gonna need to cut a square out right there. Let's let her down and hack some floor. Holy, you cut all the floor out. Oh, I don't think we're done. See that, Hunter? You like it? That's what winning looks like. We'll go expand that out and make it fit. How wide can that go? That's, that's all she's got, I think. Watch this little trick. <laughs> Borderline genius. <laughs> Borderline. Don't ask Michelle. What did you do? I just said I'm borderline genius. But not to ask. Might be true. Might not be. It depends on the day. This was genius. This may look ugly, but this is the perfect fit. Oh yeah. Have you got it up off yeah. everything where you like it? Twist it away from this shifter stuff if you can. Oh, yeah. Let's see. I think that's what I want. He's a warm one. Looks hot. Mr. Grinch. Oh, it's a Christmas song. It's that time of the year again, Michelle. Only so many shopping days. Oh, I've got her planned out, don't you worry. I know the perfect hunting gift for you. I like it better. I like it. Now we can just put the floor in, because now the exhaust is in there. I like it. That's not as bad as I anticipated, really. I thought it was going to be up in more drastic. Yeah, I won't even notice that. Yep, give me good. I opened it, but it's for you, so read away. So we got a, we got something here. What do we got? New hammer for Ben. He is a great addition to the team from Gerald. Is this so I won't break it? I you, know, you couldn't break enough stuff with my hammer, so now you got your own. It's little. Maybe you were breaking too much with the big hammers. That's a good hammer. It's a little hammer for a little man. <laughs> Let me see if this hammer works. Yeah, test it out. Hey, thank you. Yourself a new hammer. All right. That's awesome. Jeep hammer. Perfect for a Jeep bag. All right, it's morning again, and we are still on the rat rod. Today's order of business. As you can see, the exhaust is in there. We're gonna make this a floor, and maybe a steering wheel and some seats. Might as That's well. the plan. We're gonna get going and see what we can accomplish. All right, let's get a cutter. All right, Ben, now where's all the bolts? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll bolt it down. Then we'll move it. I have two. All right, we're just basically trying to get this shifter hole where we need it so that it doesn't hit. As you can see, it's hitting right there. I'm going to adjust on the shifter and move this one forward some and that one forward. Cool. We'll just put that there. If we cut like that around it, we should be able to pull it right down. All right. Well, we'll figure yeah, we it out. We are getting crazy. We're cutting this whole piece out and we're going to just add right to it here. Because um, it, it, we could adjust it. We can we, just bend the shift. We can uh, let's just heat the shifter up right here and move it forward. Barn hole. 
This is proving to be harder than I thought it might. I'll try not to melt my transmission. We'll take it. I think it's gonna work. So we got this all basically roughed in now. We still have to build this whole side, but we couldn't build it until we got this side dealt with. That's a finished product right there. Semi-finished. We gotta build something to cover that hole now, and then we gotta build this. Once we get that put in there, this is easy where I'm standing here. We get that all handled and floorboards are in. can't weather this. Well, if we made it just like you're saying, just a little Yeah, that's got to get shelf bolded. under it. So bend it and then come straight down to it. All right, so we got some marks made on here. We're going to go up and bend a little angle on this. We don't know what angle yet. We're going to bend it, check it, bend it, check it, tell it's right. The old truck was that rusty. I'll bend this one now. We're about ready to weld. That looks like that's going to be the spot. Once we finally get this floor all back in, things should go faster. This is just kind of tedious little work right here. Okay, she is going to be there. So we got the front pretty much all welded in. Now I gotta get this back piece to bend up so I can weld it right down along that. Might be easier said than done, but we're gonna give her a whirl. Right there, we'll start welding and beat the rest out to match it. So that's the gist of it. I mean, it's not smooth or flat, but it's attached and that's all that is qualified for this job. I'll fill that little hole up, pound that in, and I'm gonna eat lunch. We've, we've got a bit of a rust problem going on here. So we're going to eliminate it. Put that in. That's pretty much like I meant it. Go ahead, you can tell me that I'm good, Hunter. Oh, that was impressive. That was pretty much luck, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> but we're gonna take it and go with it. Sometimes it's better to be lucky than good. This is one of those times. I think we're gonna continue that angle. What if we just 
wind, then it wouldn't be uh, something to catch on and all that. What if we just went something like that? Bend it in. Then it would be like that. Yeah, I think something like that. We'll just taper it right in. We'll just hammer it, tack it, hammer it. I think so. We've got all our holes to fill now, see? I think we're gonna square that up. Go all across. I think we're gonna come right to those ribs and I think we'll cut it square up into there and then we can put one flat piece across that and then we can cut a piece. Then we can do our fit. edges. Yeah, we can cut, cut a piece to fit that. The side's no. about welded in. I gotta deal with that front piece and then I'll come over there and start welding. to the rib. Done with that side. This whole floorboard is done. I got that much more to weld on the other side and Ben he's currently figuring this whole thing out and then maybe we're putting some steering and seats and stuff in this sucker. Welding. We're gaining though. That side's welded in. I gotta deal with this. Somebody cut a big chunk out of that. There's little pieces there. Yeah, I see them. I gotta. We got welding. fillers. Do I got stuff on my face? This look like. Yeah, she's got a black beard. That's what it is. Hey, you're going to the dark side. If you only knew the power of the dark side. Yeah. There you go. Oh, couldn't be all this stuff I've been doing all day. I think I'm winning, man. Now all I got is these ginormous holes you cut. Sorry about that. <laughs> we didn't know quite what we were doing on this first one. It'll work good once it, we fill it. <laughs> it got better as we went to that side and done that's that true. one. So that's super thin, but yes, it's, it is. It's gonna weld. <laughs> Dang close right there. I think that'll do. Then we can make our fill in pieces. Cool. 20 or 30 more hours, I'll have this side done. <laughs> I know, right? I'll just think it'll be the last time. I hope, even if we roll it over and mangle the cab, she's gonna be what she's gonna be at that point. We'll stick the porta power in it, pull it out, weld jack it. The, <laughs> jack the cage off the seats, and we'll call her good. Send it. <laughs> I guess I'll start clubbing this together. I'll grind all this up and I'm gonna weld that in. I'm excited. Not really, I hate welding sheet metal. It's tedious, but has to be done. In a minute. I think that's the spot. We're doing it. Okay, now it's just that much welding. Check back in like an hour, I'll have her done. Sparklers on. 
Wash it up and I'll weld it. Okay, over. Pound in between those welds a little and each one will pop up. That's probably good. Can you pound this driver side up? It's got a split in it. He burnt, he burnt through on that one. Yeah. I was looking right at that one little piece right here. Where the slit is, Yeah. that's the part that needs to go up. I can weld that. We're both well hitting it. I was just trying to keep it from bouncing. Okay, it'll stay there. Now we can build a piece for it. The final little piece. Done. That is a lot of tedious freaking welding right there. Floor pans are in the tow truck. Yay! Time to go watch a baseball game. Do the shifter still work? Haha, <laughs> they don't even hit. It's like we build it that way. There's how it's supposed to be. Now we can just vacuum it out and get all yep. the metal out of it. Get all the debris out. It does look good. Let's check these out. My buddy Tom gave me these seats. He's got himself a YouTube channel. You should go check it out. It's called Big Hammer Garage. They build stuff a lot like we do. He had these seats. He wasn't going to use them. He bought them for a buggy and then they didn't work. So he gave them to me. Thought I could use them. And here they are. So go check his channel out. You might like it. I like those seats. It is time for seats. Well, we're gonna make brackets for seats. We're just gonna take this strap, use the existing holes, give us a little bit of strap here, enough for a one inch pipe on it, and we'll make a little frame that comes up here, goes across. Enough we can mount our shifter on and hold the seats to it. These seats got little bracket tabs, and we'll mount it to it. So. Just like that, trying to make brackets. That was completely safe, and that's what I meant to do, see? See, it's perfect. Hi. Oh, all right, we got the uh, brackets done. Got all these little brackets. We're gonna weld some tubes to it now. Mount some seats. And then Paul will have a nice seat to ride in on this side. We can get some exhaust up over this today. We gotta drill a hole too. In what? A couple holes. We gotta drill and tap these holes. Uh-huh, and then drill the long one through. I'm hoping it's coming out the other side. There we are. Just got back from the old baseball game. The boys played pretty good. Ben. They got some seat brackets put in it. Seats aren't mounted, but floorboards are in. We got some stuff handled this week. It was a ton of welding, but it's all, it's all gotta get done at some point. So thanks for watching.